As we observe the social sector, we see a sector that's increasingly specialized, complicated, and professionalized. Mission-driven organizations require leaders that know how to work with affected communities and are able to lead in a values-driven way. I'm Jennifer Mosley, and I'm the faculty director for the master's program in social sector leadership and nonprofit management at the University of Chicago School of Social Service Administration. This is a program that's designed for individuals that have a deep commitment to the social sector and have already experienced many of the tensions that the sector faces. We're looking for professionals that have a minimum of three to five years of work experience, many will have more, and who are ready to take the next step in advancing their careers. So I had 11 years working before I came to SSA for the master's program. And um, when I think about that experience, it was very direct service teaching for a couple years. And then it was management as a program director for a nonprofit for two years, where I was coaching teachers and supporting them. And so to me, coming to SSA felt like a real investment in my own managerial skills and my own kind of zoomed out lens of thinking about how do I not only think about managing people, and maybe even resources within an organization, but also managing the external environment around to think about how to make sure that that organization is really meeting the needs of our kids, families, clients, you know, et cetera. And I think that what happens at SSA is there's this push to think, not just to do, right? And I think SSA is positioned to do that because they're teaching broader concepts What's been helpful for me in running a business is the ability to kind of look broadly, not just narrowly, and to be able to look at other options as opposed to the ones that you have been trained to look for. As someone who had worked in the education sector and had seen SSA's master's students later on after their degrees coming to our organizations or our schools to work, I think my perception was that these students had been very rigorously trained to think deeply about not only the work right in front of them, I think, but also the dynamics at play within institutions and what levers to, are there to pull for change. So we want to produce a new generation of social sector leaders that are analytically minded, but also have a deep commitment to social justice, to racial equity, and to civic dialogue.